Hello everyone and welcome back to My Dad Smells. Today we're doing part two of my first impressions video. This is going to be the decant. So if you guys haven't seen part one, make sure to go check that out first. I will leave a link down in the description below as well as I will for each clone that I go over. So without any further ado, let's roll in my music. So as you guys know, today we're doing a first impression video, part two. So let's go right into the first one. So the first one we have is Menacera Cigarette Boys. This one I haven't heard a lot about. All I know is that I recently, in my first video, I got a cologne from this same house. And let's just see if I can smell anything. Ooh. That's a... It's a very nice sandal wood and cedar and, and leather. Those are the main smells I get from it. So I have I have pretty good hopes about this. I'm going to try and review this one pretty soon. Maybe next week, maybe the week after Thanksgiving break. It has coming up very soon. So let's get into the next one. The next one is from the same house, Manasera. This one is the ALM, which stands for Oud, Lemon, and Mint. Ooh. That's very citrusy, almondy. It's very strong. My first whiff of it was very, very strong. So... I'm a little worried about that, but I'll see how it works. Alright, next is Valentine, Valentino Umo Intense. So I am pretty excited about this one. This one, I've heard a little bit about it, but I haven't heard all that much, but I'm still not nonetheless excited to see what it smells like. So, let's get a quick look. Where is it? So, I smell leather, I smell sage oil. It's just overall very powdery, vanilla. It's just, I, I it has some really nice soft scents but also some pretty heavy scents too so that is the valentino umo intense so let's get into the next one the next one is baccarat rouge 540 this one i've heard i've heard a lot about it but i haven't heard like I don't know anything about it. I've heard about it. I'll put it that way. But, ooh. It's very... Mm, that's... It's, it's, there's cedar. There's, there's amber wood. Jasmine. So, this one I like. I... This one I think I'm gonna... I'm gonna try and do this one as soon as I can but like I said earlier I'm going to be going on vacation for Thanksgiving so I don't know how soon I will be able to do this but this is definitely one of the ones that I want to do all right next next is one that I personally wanted to get because I've heard a lot of good things about this this is initio side effect so yeah I just mm. I love every Anisha scent that I've smelled so far. So, and this one doesn't cease to disappoint. There's, there's vanilla, there's tobacco, there's cinnamon. Just overall a nice, very sweet scent. It's, if I remember from what I, what I saw, this, this comes in a purple, um, container. Which I think would look pretty good, because I have a white one and a black one. But, so, that is Anisha side effect. Now onto the last one that I have done. This one I don't know why, but it came in a much smaller bottle as you can see. 
in comparison and thickness as well is smaller but anyway nonetheless this one is Tiziana Terenzi Spirito Fiorentino so this one is a is an extremely long name for such a small bottle so let's see what it smells like anyway This one, there's there's leather, amber. It's smoky and woody. So it's this one's good. It, wow, that's actually hold on. That's a weird cap compared to the other ones. Anyway, sorry, just something I noticed. So this one, I don't know. It's not something that made me like it at first. So this one, I want to do. I want to see what other people think about it, but. I just, I didn't like it. Uh, my first smell wasn't, it didn't make me really like it. But anyway, so that is my most recent haul that we got. So just a quick little refresh of what I got. I have six, where's that little one? Right there, I got six. So I have Manacera, Oud Lemon, and mint. I have Manacera Sidrat Voice. I have Valentino Uomo Intense. I have Baccarat Rouge 540. I have two more. I have Initio Side Effects and I have Tiziana Terenzi Spirito Fiorentino. So, I will leave a link down in the description below where you can get all of these. And I won't be able to put, like, the decant place of where you can get them. But I can put, like, an estimated decant price. So, if you have someone that has a decant, I can try and, like, figure out which what price range would be best for each one so that's what I got I will I definitely I I'm going to try all of these out as soon as I can but I have some that I want to try out more than others but so if you guys like this video make sure to hit the thumbs up Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already and turn on post notifications so you know whenever I upload a new video. And also leave a comment down below. I'll get back with you. Tell me if there's, tell me if you've heard something about these colognes or tell me if you think I should get this decant or something similar to that and I will respond to you. So thanks a lot for checking me out. Have a great day.